This pink flag marks what will be the start of the new trail leading to the creek. Some residents, like Sutu Forte, are not happy about the possible addition to the neighborhood. Why keep cutting down and covering up? Forte walks these grass trails behind her home almost every day. She thinks trading the grass for cement would be unnecessary because of the existing trail. Forte gave me this map to show the existing trail and the proposed trail. The existing trail uses Old 63 South to connect Stevens Lake Park and Stadium Boulevard. The proposed trail would use Bluffdale to connect the two areas. Forte and her environmentalist group, It's Our Wild Nature, believe the Bluffdale area should remain untouched by developers. Our motto is, bike to it, walk through it. We want it to be a quiet place in Columbia where you can go and become. However, those in charge of the trail's construction think it will help more people than it will hurt. Any trail we propose, people that live in the immediate area are going to come out and say, we don't want this trail. Um, but what we found is after the trail is built, they're the ones who are the biggest users of the trail. Though the plans for the trail are now in the works, Forte says she and It's Our Wild Nature won't stop fighting for the land until the bulldozers start. Alex Arger, KOMU 8 News, Columbia.